Hey, what's cracking everybody? It's your boy Jason Yamamoto. Just to let you guys know, this is a size medium shirt, and I'm about to go into a size large. This shit's already tight as fuck as it is already. But today's topic is about common mistakes about going to the gym. This is for pretty much beginners and people who's been there for a, at least a year. All right. I know I'm just a beginner, and like I said, any information that I'm providing is just based on the little amount of experience I'm getting out of the entire situation and I like to analyze and always like to learn and me talking to the camera is just pretty much uh, me exercising uh, my experiences that way I can improve myself as well so that's how I'm doing it and hopefully you guys are taking uh, some of the information I'm spitting out and maybe you guys can relate to it but here's sort of the common mistakes about going to the gym alright a lot of people when they go to the gym they, they don't go in there with a program they don't know exactly which muscles they're working out now, when I first started working out for the first, you know, 16 weeks, first three months, right, I was on a, on a basic program that my homies hooked it up a long time ago when I was uh, starting out working out, and um, and pretty much it was a full body workout, it was meant for like CrossFit exercises, which I, at the time, I thought that was the, the workouts I needed from my body, so I, I just did it. Um, I saw minimum results, and I was overtraining, and I was always tired every time I get done with my workout. So, the first 16 weeks, I said, fuck it, this is trash. You know what I'm saying? I can't do it no more. So, I went on this other program, which is the basic uh, bodybuilder guideline. Pretty much, it's your basic compound movements and isolated movements. And you practice these compound movements and isolated movements until you... Perfected them, perfected them, and then you move on to more advanced workouts, right? That's what how it usually works. Now, the twins, you know, TMW, they got their own basic guideline. They put it on their website, you know, to buildmusclefast.com. But uh, for me, since I'm an ectomorph, um, I'm kind of modified in myself. Even though a lot of people just say don't modify that shit, but you know, I, hey, it's my body. I do what the fuck I want to do with it. Um, so if if you guys want the basic uh, program, I'm going to put it in the uh, info section below, but yeah, like I say, like I said, like a lot of beginners or people who's been going to the gym for at least a year, they go in there, they don't even know what the fuck they're doing, like, they'll hit chest, you'll, you'll notice them, they'll hit chest, and the next thing they'll hit shoulders, and the next thing they'll hit legs, which is the, pretty much a full body workout, which you don't get to concentrate on any of the muscles that you're trying to work on. I actually found better results work concentrating on certain areas like my chest on on Mondays, chest and tries, and then on Tuesday I work out shoulders, and then on Wednesday I work back back and biceps, and then on Thursday I work um, legs, and then on Friday it's usually arms, and then if I can squeeze in some uh, abdominal area I do it, right, and then usually Saturday and Sunday I just take a break because. Resting is the most important part of uh, bodybuilding and also training. If you ain't resting, then you just you're just fucking yourself up. So yeah, man. So hopefully you guys take this information and uh, maybe you guys can use it to maybe help yourself. Um, it's your boy Jason Yamamoto, and I'll talk to you guys later.